Now the full moons are great for charging your crystals too. If there's something that you want to draw into your life or something that you want to manifest because the full moons are all about abundance and about this filling up of energy. Um, whereas if you wanted to remove something from your life or clear something out, you might want to consider charging your crystals with a waning moon energy. Is it too cold to put them outside? Well, depending on where you live right now, it could be too cold to put your crystals outside. Outside. Um, the reason for that is because rapid temperature changes in your stones can cause them to crack. So freezing and thawing, for instance, or even just having them be at the room temperature in your home and then putting them outside if it's too cold, it can cause your crystals to crack. So you do want to be really cautious about that, um, especially if you're attracted to the aesthetics of your stone. You definitely would want to be really careful. The other thing is if you're putting crystals outside, um, you want to make sure that if there's going to be any type of rain or snow or precipitation that you're putting stones out that are of a relatively high hardness because you don't want those stones to melt. Like we talked a little bit about last time, selenite for instance over time can actually melt or get sort of dull um, from water and there are lots of other stones like that too. So just sort of be cautious about that. Um, but to cleanse them in the moonlight if that's um, what you're referring to, I actually feel that they don't have to be outside. You can actually just place your crystals right on your windowsill and that will do a lot of good too. Now anytime that sun or moonlight has to go through glass of your window panes and is filtered on its way in it's going to be reduced in effectiveness a little bit so when you can it's best to put them outside but right now it's winter it can be a little bit too cold and there's like I said a lot of temperature shifts happening so just be cautious about that. If you live in a southern climate um, then you'll definitely uh, be able to do that a little bit sooner than the rest of us.